What's up guys? Good morning. It's Coco back with another video. So basically, I'm gonna be trying to see if I could hit 4,000 calories in one day. Let me change for the gym because I gotta hit the gym early today. Let's go, let's go. We can't waste no time, boys. We can't. So this first meal, believe it or not, comes out to 1,350 calories. The protein powder that I have right now alone is 1,250 calories. And I added fruit and the almond milk. So that's a lot of calories to start off the bat. So we're already at a good place with this milkshake. So yeah, now we just gotta get this down and then we'll hit the gym and we'll go on with our eating day. You already know what's up. That was a good workout. I'm feeling good. Living better. It's like, not yet, not yet. I'm feeling good. That's it. Now we're heading home. And then around 9 o'clock, it's 8.40 right now. We'll get the meal too, baby. So you already know where we're going to have some eggs. My mom finally got me some egg whites. Shout out, mom. Get some toast. Uh, oatmeal. All right, so the breakfast is done. We got four egg whites. Two pieces of toast with cream cheese. Some oatmeal with peanut butter and chia seeds. So this whole meal is going to add up to 800 calories. So let's get to eating. Meal number two is done. And currently we're sitting about like 2,100 calories. So now I guess we just wait for meal number three. I don't know what meal number three is gonna be, so we'll see. Okay, so let's talk about some facts. So today I'm off of work and usually when I'm at work, I might go to like a little dirtier type of diet. But when I'm home, I'll go for a more cleaner type of diet. You know, I'm not the best cook, so I'll just try to cook whatever I can. The only thing I really know how to cook is some eggs, oatmeal, chicken, rice. So I keep it super basic. You just gotta get creative with the types of cooking that you do. So my meal three now is gonna be tuna. I'm gonna put two little cans of tuna. I'm gonna mix it up with some corn. We're gonna have two tuna sandwiches. All right, so we got two of them bad boys. And then we got that. So all of this comes out to 800 calories, if I eat it all. I mean, I'm gonna force myself, so. All right, so for any of you guys bulking or trying to eat a lot, in the first eight minutes, after the eight minutes, that's when your mind starts to tell you that you're full. So if you get as much down before eight minutes, you're kinda in the clear. But there's a lot of food before eight minutes. So I finished it. I didn't think I was gonna finish it, but I did. So that's 
600 calories down the hatch. And right now we're at 2,750 calories. All right, so I'm going in for a snack right now and I'm having a rice pudding, then a granola bar. So I'm about to eat that up. Okay, now it's time for dinner. My mama, great cook, superb cook. She made some rice, some meat, and some so I've calculated all the calories and that meal has 888 calories. So after I finish that, that'll put me at 3,938 calories for the day. So I'll only need like a few more calories after that. So I'm about to eat this. All right guys, I'm here with my last and final meal. This meal is going to be taking me over the 4,000 calorie mark. It's actually going to take me to the 4,000 298 calorie mark. So this meal came out to 360 calories. This is just a little snack. Some yogurt, granola, some blueberries. I just want to let you guys know, I don't always eat like this. It's always on and off. Whenever I'm home, I try to stick to a healthier, clean diet. Whenever I have work, I tend to go a little bit to the dirtier side. So yeah, if you guys are out there trying to surplus on them calories, it's all right if you go a little bit to the dirtier side. It's all right if you stick healthy, but Healthier, I feel, is a little more demanding because you got to cook for yourself. You got to cook more. You got to, you know, but the dirtier side is a little easier way. It's a little cheat cheat, I feel. It's all about that dedication, discipline, consistency with working out. Just keep those in mind and you guys will reach your goals in no time. So, yeah, guys, maybe soon I'll do a 10,000 calorie challenge because this one was a little bit easy. That's the end of the video. I hope you guys liked it. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe. Peace out. Go hustle. Before I leave, I want to say the message of the day. The message of the day is if you have a goal, make sure you double down on how hard you could work at it. Make sure you double down on how much time you spend on it. Because although you think you're working hard right now, someone is out there working 10 times harder than you. Keep that in mind. Double down twice as hard as you're working on it right now.